Spider-Man number 236 by Brian Michael Bendis and Oscar Bazuldua. Genki and Danica make out on a bench when she again brings up her nagging obsession of Spider-Man's identity. Not surprising at all, he blurts it out, and Miles' best friend is forced to come clean with his own secret ID. In Brooklyn, the mother and daughter bombshells argue on a rooftop. Lana intends to go good, but her mom disagrees. Suddenly, Spider-Man appears, but even he is no match for the next reveal. The Iron Spider crouches behind her and tells his unknowing nephew to go home. Lana is in no mood for games, though, and she blasts Iron Spider, leading to her mother following suit. With Lori now lying on the ground unconscious, the web slingers square off. As they battle, the fight seems evenly matched. They trade blow for blow, with eventually Miles asking if he knows this masked baddie. Meanwhile in San Diego, a tiny Sandman inspects the crevices of a fallen sentinel when a horde of old school Nick Fury clones run towards him. They're all shocked into oblivion and fall to the ground motionless. Electro has completely fried the outdated shield security. They both meet topside to discuss. The plan to steal the helicarrier is still valid, but cutting Iron Spider out just makes too much sense. Spot appears and they agree. Three-way split. With that, they take off. Back in Brooklyn, the battle continues. His uncle tells him how scrappy of a street fighter he's become. When Bombshell accidentally blows something up so hardcore, Spidey and his uncle are rattled. As her mother goes on a hair-pulling tantrum, Miles hits the Iron Spider with his electric rope things when he sees him. Uncle Aaron says his name, and as the teenager tries to reckon with it, he's knocked unconscious. What will happen next? Will Miles be able to bring his supposed dead uncle back to the good side? Will the bombshells ever be able to be civil with each other again? We'll have to wait, as this issue is left to be continued. Well, one thing is for sure, Brian Michael Bendis is planning one hell of an amazing exit. I think it might be arguable that he truly saved the best for last, as this arc leaves nearly nothing off limits. Miles idolized his uncle, and to have to deal with any more drama in his already crazy life just makes where this can go all that much more interesting. I give this one a 9 out of 10. If you like this video, there's hundreds more like it, spinning several current and classic story arcs. Click the boxes here for more playlists. This video is also accompanied by my blog at nerdyaskinyano.com. You can also follow links to my Facebook or Twitter pages, as well as a link to this very issue for sale on my eBay page by clicking below. For the nerdiest kid you know, I'm Sam Torito. Thanks for watching.